300 BH, this is one of our most popular bunkhouse models. I have couples that are got families, kids. Um, this is one of the first ones I always have to answer questions about just because it's so popular. There's not very many campgrounds in America you can go to and, and not see one of these okay. just because they're so popular. Uh, you can actually get into one of these under $30,000, so that's crazy. Uh, unheard of and get a payment right around 230 bucks a month. That's great on a on a humongous bunkhouse um, So let's talk about some of the features on the okay. outside. Okay One of the first things that always stands out to me is these steps I, We talk about them all the time But I I really think that this is one of the most key features that they've upgraded in the industry for people mm -hmm. um, uh, I don't think that anybody would want anything else after they've had, seen these they're very sturdy very nice to stay yeah if, if somebody's watching and they say why do they keep talking about these steps there is a huge difference this there's is a, a huge there's difference, 30 yeah. steps and I've mm -hmm. gone up some of the others and and even even RVs that weren't around here but just going into places with steps that aren't as nice these you don't feel nervous walking up these no, steps you don't. yeah so as you can see the awning it, it, it's a good size awning so you get a lot of good cover as far as on the front side when you guys are sitting outside entertaining doing whatever it might be that you and your family like to enjoy doing uh -huh. um, but also it does have all the outside entertainment uh, with the, the speakers that is connected to the inside so it's like a surround sound system all remote control you got your access to hook up your tv right here already ready to rock and roll for you with all the outlets that you'll need to plug into if you want to go satellite dish you can if you want to go with the cable in the park if they if they have that mm -hmm. you just plug right in directly you can bring your box from home, no problem. It all works right, right. through this coach here. Um, storage department, one of my favorite features on these is it's a pass-through storage, full pass-through storage, which is, allows you to store tons and tons of stuff that, that you don't have to have uh, all around the campsite or anything like that. Really nice to get to with the pass-through storage. It's got the, autom uh, the automatic stabilizer jacks, and this has got the solar ready panels so that you can go ahead. If you did have to do some boondocking, uh -huh. you can do that, and okay. you can utilize the, the uh, Furion solar power portable solar panel system that we provide here as well. Good. Power tongue jack in the front. I think they do a great job with their, their front cap on here, all fiberglass, uh, very durable. Nice slick design on there, very aerodynamic, uh, allows you to, to really have a nice look when you're going down the road. Uh -huh. Looks good. Yeah, it does. It's all kitchen in the back? They do have a kitchen. So let's take a look at the kitchen. I like these kitchens. These are one of my favorite cooktops out on an outside kitchen. Uh -huh. uh, I, I just really think that the Capitol Grill that we provide here with the open flame is really nice. I'm not, you know, opposed to the electric burn top, but I'm, I'm a big fan of seeing a flame when uh -huh. I cook. I just like the instant heat. Right. That's something that I think yeah, is I very important. Yeah, I haven't seen these yet. Yeah, these are very cool, very nice. Um, right here, you got plenty of room, uh, plenty of cabinet space, so when you're cooking, you know, you can even put dishes up here. Mm -hmm. You, got, you, you don't have to go in and out. You got a place if you did have something out here like a microwave, uh, small a microwave. microwave or you know an air fryer, whatever you were doing, you got a place to put that right here if you need to. Got your sink to rinse out all your stuff when you're out here. And then you do also have your fridge still. I think this one's still You're opening tapered. it from the wrong side. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. So you still finally, got plenty of- I finally of, knew something. They, they got plenty of space in these as well still for you. Uh, to utilize when you need to put stuff in here so that you're not, like I said, in and out, in and out, in right. and out. And what is, what is this thing right here? Uh, well, th that's a, <laughs> that's a bottle opener, let's just say. Oh, that <laughs> yeah, that's what that is. That's dad's bottle opener for there, there. That easy access when you're cooking and grilling out, you know, you don't have there to. There you go, it's right yeah, there. It's right there. And then here's your. That's where you keep yeah, That's where dad's fridge is. Yeah. There. So it's nice, <laughs> nice how they got this design. Get something out of the fridge. There's, you as know. long as you open from the right side. <laughs> there you go. You'd be here 15 minutes trying to open this and never get it. Right. So the cool <laughs> thing about this, this is a bunkhouse. You got kids. They like to go outside. They get dirty, and you don't want to bring them in the coach. Go ahead and utilize the outside shower as well and spray mm -hmm. them off before they go in there so they're not, you know, tearing up everything, making a muddy mess in the house. Yeah. You don't have to worry about none of that as well. And this one is also backup ready, camera prep so that we can go ahead and plug you in so you can see when you're backing things up. Cool. Let's take a look inside. Yeah. Man, 
it feels like everyone I get into seems roomier. Yeah. So we'll just go right to the bunkhouse because <laughs> this is what people want to look at when they come in these. This is what they're looking for when they look at a bunkhouse unit. Um, this might be the nicest bunk house. I was I've just seen about here. to say. So you know, you got the couch that folds into the bed. We got it folded down into the bed uh, right now. But you know, you can go ahead in the daytime if the kids are back here with their entertainment center mm -hmm. pre-wired for TV, everything you might need back here. Game system, however it is that you keep your your youngins occupied, they have that there readily available. Also have if you got a little older children, you got your cell phone charging ports on each side. So that, that's not taken away from some of the outlets that you might be utilizing. Uh -huh. You can maximize all that stuff as well. But during the day, you can just go ahead and put this up. And then we just flip this up into the couch. And then you can just go ahead and entertain that way in here yeah. as well, which is kind of nice especially if you have adults staying over and you don't have kids, they can kind of utilize this as an extra bedroom if they mm -hmm. wanted to and still have somewhere decent to sit, right. have a little space, a little separation if that's something you desire. I saw uh, some storage underneath yeah. there. Yeah, like, so uh, Wildwood does an outstanding job of the storage that they provide in all their coaches. We're gonna go look at a couple of the other features when it comes okay. to storage on the inside. They, they do everything they can to maximize the, every little bit of space uh, for you to have for storage moving forward. So you don't have to worry about none of that. They do have a dresser in here, which is nice because not every bunkhouse has anything like this. Once again, kids have somewhere to organize their clothes or whatever it is, or if you just need it for extra storage, mm -hmm. it's there for you. So yeah, this nice is bunkhouse. definitely the nicest bunkhouse I've seen yet. For sure. It's one of our most popular. Okay. The huge farm style sink. Everybody loves this. Um, you got the kid sprayer. <laughs> it shoots right back to the yeah, bunkhouse. You don't have up. to worry about nothing, so that <laughs> works out pretty well. Um, but they do have a full-size pantry. Oh, yeah? Yeah, which is awesome. So, you know, you can if you're going to stay extended periods of time uh -huh. in this coach, this allows you to not have to make several trips back and forth to the grocery store. you got plenty of room to put whatever, right. whatever canned goods you might need or, you know, those items that you need to store. You're going to have the, the room to That's do good. that. Mm-hmm. Three cook top, Furian, one of my favorite. I think they just do a really good job. Um, I don't hear a, any negative feedback on this brand. I see that name a lot. Yeah, and it's I one of my favorite every, ones. Almost everyone we're in. Yeah, I've heard a lot of good feedback about okay. it. So that's these are ones that I really care about uh, selling to my customers because I know they're not gonna have trouble down the road. It's something that they can use for a very long time. Okay. Um, I, I, I don't mind putting my name on something like this because I know it does well. Yeah. Also has the oven in here, so if you want to cook uh, chicken or whatever you want to do, bake mm -hmm. whatever, uh, you can do that within this. Got your re your regular full size microwave that you would have in your house. Mm -hmm. Full size refrigerator still in this unit. Doesn't take away any space at all by utilizing this. It's a nice size fridge too. Oh yeah, it's deep. Yeah. Bigger than your college dorm room. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's it's. Very easy to adjust those. Yeah. I mean, I, I can't because of that, but you just pull that out and slide it in. A lot of them, you have to do a lot of twisting and turning. That makes Absolutely. it a lot easier. I don't know if they've seen back here, but there is tons of storage still underneath the sink here. You can get into um, plenty of places for your utensils, whatever you might need to store in there. Take a look at the uh, master bedroom. Yeah. So in here, feels real good in here. Oh, it does feel good in here. <laughs> <laughs> so they do have the wardrobes on the side for mom and dad to uh -huh. utilize to store any clothes that you might need to have with some nice overhead space as well with the overhead lighting push button. Uh, plenty of space to sit up and read your books. Nothing like hanging down to bother you. This is a nice comfort of wet mattress. It's got the soft pillow top feel to it. Uh -huh. So that's something that people are looking for if they're going to spend any type of time in a coach for a long time. You know, you don't want to be sit, laying on a piece of plywood. Right. You know, this this thing is going to provide the comfort that you're looking yeah. for. With the, with an access to the bathroom from your bedroom. So, you know, if you're getting up in the night to use the bathroom, you're not bothering it's anybody right out there. there. Uh, Two-way door to go to the bathroom. So that's kind of nice. If we want to take a look into the bathroom to see what it looks like. Uh, the, the shower in here, I really like it. There's a lot of space. 
Yeah. I'll let you show me. And I mentioned earlier that uh, we talked about a bigger shower than these corner showers. Talking about these corner showers being a little smaller, but there's still plenty of room in these things. There is. They're smaller than the, some of the bigger ones we've seen, obviously, but I, when my wife and I stayed, we had plenty of room in there. I didn't mm -hmm. hear her complaining that, that she didn't have enough room, so yeah, these are, these are good. And they do a good job because they actually provide you a vanity to put places in, and it opens up and you've got places for your toothbrush, for whatever you need to do, and you're not just trying to put it all, get it out in a little baggie, yeah. do your thing. You don't have to worry about none of that. They have it's an right actual there. yeah, vanity, a medicine cabinet, whatever you, you call that, that you can utilize and, and not have to worry about having bags everywhere with toothbrushes, toothpaste, what do you know, right. you, you got plenty of room. Control center Control here. Control center. Yep. Uh, we got your Jensen. Like I was telling you, it's all remote control. Inside and out provides the surround sound feel that we were talking about. And what Wildwood does a good job of, I think, is keeping things simple as far as their control panel. It's not confusing. It's not a lot of digital buttons and let me read a manual to figure out how to push what button to get to what button. Uh -huh. It's just right here. You know, real simple and easy. I, I like that for, especially if you, you're not, uh, you know, real user friendly when it comes to those computer screens yeah. and things like yeah. that. That makes things, well, that we makes life a little easier. Obviously, this is going to sound terrible. I mean, don't mean to make it sound terrible. We talk about, you know, older people in retirement getting to the point where they're ready to mm -hmm. settle down and maybe travel and that, that does make it a lot easier Makes instead of trying easier. to learn something yeah. brand new. Absolutely. It's all right there. And, and they seem to like that quite a bit. Yeah. So, uh, still some more storage under here for, you know, whatever you need uh, as far as your entertainment area. If you need to put a box in there, you can put a box in there. No problem doing that. Uh, you got your mounted TV bracket so it does swivel around. Uh, in case somebody's sitting over here, you're playing card, doing whatever you're doing, you can still watch, utilize the yep. TV access. And this does turn into a bed as well, just the same as the dinette. Okay. So you got tons of sleeping in here. Actually, it sleeps 10, ten people, yeah. this unit. So wow. that's why it becomes so popular. I don't even know 10 people. Well, well and, and when people <laughs> call me, they talk about, you know, we're looking at bunkhouse, we got three or four kids. You know, sometimes Sally or John wants to bring friend, friend, and friend. Yeah. You know, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I can't afford to get one of these humongous fifth wheels. You know, what do you got to show me? And this is really where we take them. Yeah, for what did you say, 230 um, bucks? $230 a month for something like this, yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. Do we have Love any questions it. on this one today? I haven't. Uh, no, Dave usually shows up pretty quick if we have questions, so you must have nailed it with the, uh, with the explanation. Very More good. More storage here. Well, if they have any questions, like I said, I gave my phone number before, but you can contact me at 877-877-4494, extension 150. Just ask for Tim. Uh, I'll help you the best I can. I'll get you the best deal I can provide to you through RV Wholesalers. Answer any questions that you might have. And you can also e email me at any time, tcastle at rvwholesalers.com. Perfect. All right. Well, thank you, sir.